Christmas trees are on the go. The lights have been lit here in Bor. Letters have been written to Santa. We're in full swing in this preparation for Christmas. It's the season of purple. We know it as Advent time. The four weeks before Christmas Day. It coincides with the month of December. It's a time of waiting to celebrate the birth of baby Jesus. Purple is the colour of devotion. Purple is the colour for royalty. One of the lovely ways of celebrating Advent is to make an Advent wreath and place it in the sacred space at home. You will need some sort of greenery, could be holly, laurel or palm. We make them into a circle. The circle reminds us of the circle of life and the circle of God's love. The evergreen branches speak to us of God always being with us. We have five candles, four of them for the four weeks of Advent, three purple and one pink. The first purple candle is for the prophets. It is the candle for hope. The prophets, those wise men and reflective people, foretold that Jesus was to be born. Our second purple candle for week two is Mary and Joseph's candle and their journey to Bethlehem. The third week of Advent, we light the pink candle. This Sunday is known as Rejoicing Sunday or Godetta Sunday. It is the candle of the shepherds who experience the joy of the news of the birth of Jesus. The third purple candle is lit on the fourth Sunday. It is the candle of the angels and the symbol of love. The message of the angels was peace on earth to all. Then on Christmas Eve, we light the fifth candle at the center of the wreath. It is Jesus' candle. He is here. We celebrate his birth. God our Father, through the power of the Holy Spirit, you send your Son Jesus to come as a little child to lead us on our Advent journey. As we prepare this Advent for his coming again, open our hearts to the wonder of his presence in our lives. Heal our wounds, bless our efforts, and make us gentle of heart. Amen.